Good morning, Lions. Today is Wednesday, November 18th, 2020. Welcome to another awesome day of learning here at Lemoore Elementary. We're excited you're here and we know it's going to be a great day because you're going to roar like a lion. Respect, on task, achieve, and responsibility. All right, Lions, today's weather calls for cloudy skies and a high of 68. The green air quality flag is flying, which means the air is unhealthy for everyone. As of now, we're only supposed to have drizzles this morning and no more rain. Um, so we're crossing our fingers for that. But we are on minimum day schedule today because of parent conference. So today, tomorrow, Thursday, and Friday, we all get out at 125. Okay, Lions? So that's a reminder. Um, so today, being Wednesday, you will all have PE, but it will be a very shortened PE time. It will be 20 minutes, okay, Lions? Um, so again, we're not anticipating rain the rest of the day, but we'll keep a close eye on it and let you know if that changes. All right, birthdays. Today we have Melanie Gutierrez turning 10 in Miss Max class. Lawson Jeffers is 5 in Miss Rose's class. Zachary Medina is turning 12 in Miss Rose's class, and Miguel Solano will be 10 in Miss Max class. Happy birthday, Lions! All right. Um, on this date, in 1928, Steamboat Willie was aired for the first time, and that's Disney's first cartoon. That's right. Walt Disney released his first cartoon with Steamboat Willie, and guess what? Steamboat Willie... That actually was Mickey Mouse playing Steamboat Willie. So our very first Mickey Mouse cartoon came out on this day in 1928. And you can see Mickey Mouse is back over here behind me. I can never get this quite right. There you go. There's Mickey. All right. Um, some announcements. Just so there was reminders. We have to wear our masks, ladies and gentlemen, over our face. Okay? Not here. Not down here. Over our face. Okay? And I know some of you guys are wearing them and they, they're a little bit big. You might have adult masks. Um, you can take the mask and you can twist the ears. And sometimes doing that makes them tighter. See, I have the same problem. My face is very narrow. Okay. And I also know that several of you guys, it's been a problem because of glasses because they fog up your glasses. Right. It makes it hard. So I, I understand you. They say that if you put a piece of Kleenex in here, it helps to block it. So if you put a piece of Kleenex in the inside, in here, it actually helps to block the steam, right, from fogging up your glasses. All right, Lions? All right. And remember, if you do not come with a mask, we will have one for you, but you will not be able to enter any buildings or anything like that unless you have a mask on. All right. Today, again, is minimum day scheduled. So is, when, so is Thursday and Friday. Report cards go home today. All right, Lions, if you are here in person, you will get be taking your report cards home. If you are a distance learner, you will be receiving yours in the mail. They will be mailed out this week. Um, and conferences are going on. So if you've already had your conference, you may get your report card taken home. You can take it home with you as, excuse me, as well. All right, next week is Thanksgiving week, and we are all off of... Um, work and school for Thanksgiving week. So Lions, next week, start, start thinking about what you're thankful for and remember to tell your parents, your family, thank you for doing all the things they do for you every day. And hey, don't forget about your teachers too. All right, Lions. Um, we have a couple of shout outs and I am very, very um, happy with these shout outs. They come from the Washington building. So I want to give a shout out to Mrs. Farmer's class first. Um, they've shown some great leadership qualities the last few days. They've had a couple of different subs, and there were times when, you know, it's like, oh, another different sub. But you guys did an amazing job showing leadership, showing maturity, and being a good representative of what ROAR stands for. So thank you so much to Ms. Farmer's class. Now, also, <clears throat> to Miss Rodriguez's and Mrs. Casillas' classes yesterday, you guys had the same sub, one in the morning, one in the afternoon. She went between the classes, and she came into the office yesterday just talking about what an amazing day she had, what great classes, both classes she was in. She just went on and on about how they were the best classes she's been in in a long time. So, Lions, that is an amazing way to show how to roar 
when you have a guest teacher. Thank you to Mrs. Rodriguez and Mrs. Sipple's class for following all the roar while you had a guest teacher. Way to go, Lions. Now, remember, when we have guest teachers that come to our school, they go to other schools, too. And we want them to be able to leave here at Lamore Elementary and say, wow, those kids were amazing, and go to another school and tell them how amazing we are, right? So you guys, all of you that I'm giving shout-outs today have been doing an awesome job with that. So thank you so much to our Washington Building students. All right, Lions, last thing. We're going to pick out five more today of our red tickets. For our Jefferson students, there's three, there's four, and one more makes five. Okay, so we have Luis Eduardo Correa from Miss Cherry's class, Jace from 6J, um, Jaden V from 7J, Sharif from Miss Cherry's class, and Angel Villarreal from Miss Shiloh's class. You guys can come up on up and pick something from the prize bucket today. Um, otherwise, and then if you're not here, it's okay. If they're absent, we'll hold on to them, and they have till Friday to come and pick their prize. All right, Lions, I think that's all I have for you for this wonderful Wednesday. That was a lot of information. Thank you for sticking with me. All right, Lions, it is now time for the flag salute. 